Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. If you're new here, make sure you like and subscribe, it really helps the channel. As you can see, I am close to uh, remonetizing my channel. We had uh, 1,000 subscribers, I'm like at 800, uh, what is it now, like 813, 815, something like that. And uh, some of my subscribers might be like, well, hey, weren't you monetized before? I'm like, yeah, I was a few years back. But then a lot of people may or may not know that YouTube came up with this thing where they, like, demonetized, I don't know, hundreds, probably thousands of people's channels. A lot of people were unhappy about it. Like, well, you know, people are getting views, but they don't have any, as many subscribers. So I didn't have, well, I had probably, like, or 500 subscribers, something like that, and uh, then they decide to put a cap at a minimum of a thousand subscribers, and then a certain amount of watch hours, and everything like that, so, uh, yeah, well, um, uh, anyways, so here's the reason why I'm making this video, so Johnny Depp hacked my YouTube, <laughs> it's, uh, well, probably not Johnny Depp directly, I don't think Johnny really cares whether or not someone on YouTube has anything to say about him at all, especially like just what would be like me, like a random channel, like mine is a gaming channel, I put, you know, custom music videos on there, uh, a lot of different games I played, mostly uh, Star Wars, the online role-playing game, um, some others in there, uh, some uh, Power Ranger games, some uh, Westwood games, this and that, you know. But, uh, yeah, so a few weeks ago, I know a few of my subscribers commented in my videos like, hey, what happened? And I tried to answer it. But I was actually in the middle of a crisis that was happening then because I'm just doing my thing, uploading like a few videos here and there, you know. And then all of a sudden, I'm on my main page and just all my videos disappeared, just gone. Like the page was blank. And then I'm like, okay, what just happened? You know, uh, I'm like panicking at that time. I thought that my channel had been deleted. Or like I lost all my content, which is uh, years of content. Uh, you know, because uh, I actually had, uh, when I was in school, I had some uh, 3D animation videos that I was doing, a lot of original content and models, 3D models that I had made myself. A lot of those videos, content on there, going back to, uh, oh, I don't know, 09, 10, 11, something like that. So, yeah, at least a decade, per se, or more of probably, uh, I think I have like 1,500 videos on here, something like that. But, yeah, a lot of it had just, uh, yeah, and anyways, so everything was just gone. And then my name had, has gone, my banner was gone, and I'm just like, what is happening? So I'm refreshing, I'm, you know, looking at my email, seeing if anything, any notifications, like, so, like YouTube has been like, oh, you uh, uh, broke the guidelines or, or something like that. And I'm just like, what is happening? <laughs> so all of a sudden the name changes from my name which is, if anybody was ever wondering how to pronounce it, it's actually R. De Boss 88 And at the time, I had chosen that because uh, it, it sounded like a, a really cool vampire name, you know, for Twilight ruined everything. <laughs> Just kidding. Um, anyways, uh, yeah, so uh changed from my name to Johnny Depp, and I'm looking at him like, what the hell just happened? You know, so it says Johnny Depp on there, and then all of a sudden there's this live stream on there, and I'm just like, hold on. I saw this live stream probably at the time a week or two beforehand, so this is like right after the trial had happened. Um, he had uh, done a live press conference, and it uh, uh, my, my channel was playing that as um, 
live. I was just like, okay, well, first of all, this is definitely, definitely not live. You know, <clears throat> excuse me. Uh, yeah, uh, uh, I had already seen this recording. I I recognize, um, you know, the uh, uh, the video. You know, I'm like, hold on, I, I heard him say that exact sentence before, and I'm just like, well, what is going on? So I looked at the uh, YouTube editor studio, and thankfully, all of my videos were still there. You know, uh, they had, uh, actually, thank God they have not been deleted. They were just merely changed from, you know, public to hidden, you know. And so all, all of my videos were hidden. And I'm just like, well, that's a relief. <laughs> and, uh, well, I, at that point, I'm just like, okay, I got to change my login, change my email, check, you know, my email uh, make sure that that uh, you know my inbox hadn't been compromised, which it wasn't, thankfully. But you know, nevertheless, I changed passwords. I added security here and there, and you know, uh, in the midst of that, um, I think the live video had been going on probably somewhere between 45 minutes to an hour. Uh, you know, when I had discovered it, some something like that, and I'm just like. Why the hell? The whole the whole time, just freaking out that <laughs> I might lose all my content, you know. And um, uh, so, I, I, while the live stream was going on, I I could actually like see it in the editor, so I couldn't stop it or really like turn it off at first. But what I could do was edit it. So I cleared the description, changed the title, like, "Hey, everyone." This is not Johnny Depp's channel. I don't think Johnny even has a channel. He might, who knows? Didn't look that up. Um, but yeah, this is my channel. Don't watch this. It's being hacked. If anyone can help me, <laughs> you know, some people know, uh, may have noticed that. I think there's something probably uh, nearly 2,000 people who are watching it live at the time. And some people may have noticed it, may have not. But yeah, I changed all that. And then eventually. I could, uh, you know, turn it off. So I, I turned it off. You know, I, I I deleted that. And the thing with my, um, my um, my videos is that I had to republic them individually. So I was like, oh my god, going through page after page, video after video, just public save, public save, public save. You know, so, I mean, that was a, a whole ordeal in itself. So, yeah, I mean, uh, everybody knows, and if you haven't, if you don't know by now, you're probably living under a rock or something, but Johnny Depp had his trial, and you should definitely know who Johnny Depp is. And, you know, probably his most famous role, arguably, Captain Jack Sparrow. Love that character, love the movies. You know, and some of his other ones, uh, his first role there, I believe it was uh, Nightmare on Elm Street. And uh, when he was on Inside the Actor Studio, it was kind of funny. As uh, Lipton was like, hey, you know, uh, you were in uh, Nightmare. What what happened then? And John's only response was, I get sucked into a bed. <laughs> Funniest thing. I was like, yeah, yeah, that happened. <laughs> Yeah, Johnny has uh, so many iconic roles that people love over the years in his career. You know, he had uh, Captain Jack, obviously, the Mad Hatter from Alice in Wonderland, uh, Edward Scissorhands. Um, you know, uh, more recently, uh, he played Grindelwald in uh, Fantastic Beasts and just so many other characters that people just love over the years. You know, and of course, uh, it was funny, it actually came up in the trial, where it was like, yeah, Disney, you know, they just took sides against me, uh, Johnny saying, you know, stating that they took sides against me, you know, they they branded me guilty before innocent, you know, but uh, like you said, they didn't stop, you know, <laughs> uh, with the movies, they didn't stop with the Johnny merchandise, video games, 
t-shirts, action figures, et cetera. They didn't stop selling any of that. And, <laughs> and, and it was funny. One of the lawyers was just like, if you believe even half of the things you're saying about him, it's ridiculous because Captain Jack is, is more drunk and more high than Johnny has ever been because Johnny got clean not too long ago. You know, and just his testimony when he had, uh, you know, his prescription, he's talking about, you know, how he needs it. It's just heartbreaking to listen to someone going through something like that. And, of course, you know, this Amber Heard thing, it's just completely ridiculous. You know, he's suing her for defamation because she came out with this whole thing about him being a wife beater doing this, doing that, and <laughs> and she's like, oh, you brought all these people out of the woodwork later in the trial. I'm like, okay, first of all, you accused him of, like, tearing up a bar and, like, messing you up and just saying all kinds of crap, but the owner and manager of the bar came on the stand and said, no, Johnny didn't do any of that. You were screwing around. <laughs> Amber was screwing around. Like, oh, yeah, he came out of the woodwork. And, like, the manager owner who was working that night in question out of the woodwork. And just so many other examples like that. Security guards, his ex-wife, people like that. It uh, got ridiculous. And, you know, whenever Amber was on the stand, you're listening to her. I'm like, okay, uh-huh. And then five minutes later, a few sentences down the line, whatever, she contradicted herself. And I was just like, huh? <laughs> I was just like, if you honestly believed anything that Amber had to say after it's been proven left and right with eyewitnesses, with video, you know, with audio, that all of everything that she had to say was just pure fabrication. You know, nothing, nothing more than that. Just... Her trying to hurt him, essentially what all this was about. Like, why, why would you ever want to hurt Johnny? What did Johnny ever do to you? Has Johnny loved you? Johnny married you? Johnny bought you a horse? Johnny paid for all of your expenses? I mean, uh, everything, groceries, you know, houses. Pretty sure that's plural. And vacations on his private island. I was just like, why would you want to ever hurt someone who gave you everything and more? And even later, when he felt that he had given you everything and you still want to take, you know, he, he, <laughs> he opened up the vein and said, here, take my blood. It's just, I mean, it's a little extreme, but when you're at that point, you know, you all kinds of things happen when you're dealing with heartache, especially when it's happening right before your eyes and there's nothing that you can do about it. I mean, you can try left and right. You can say yeah, everything you want till you're blue in the face. But when someone hurts you like that and they're clearly cheating on you, I mean, there's video proof of her and uh, what's his name? Uh, well, I'm pretty sure Elon Musk was one of them, and uh, let's just, I'm blanking on his, his name right now, but uh, uh, James Franco, that's the guy, James Franco, there's literally video proof of the two of them entering the penthouse together, and it's just like, come on, come on, you know, I mean, come on, if you look at any of the pictures from Johnny's last days, even last couple of years with her, he does not look happy in them at all, and he's usually sporting, like, a black eye or a cut or something, and you can just tell something is wrong, you know, I mean, it is the last problem, <laughs> to say the least. Yeah, so, uh, yeah, there's the, the live stream. Um, yeah, so, so it, here's the thing with that, is that after I had cleared everything, you know, the, the video live stream, um, I, I 
finally, you know, took that down, got all of my videos back up, uh, got them to be public again. Um, I changed the name back from Johnny to my name. Um, I was really mad because the banner that I had put on my channel that, um, uh, that I, it was, um, uh, part of a, uh, an art project that I was doing while I was still in college and I didn't even mean to do it on purpose. You know, I was really modeling with Maya, working with the UVs and in Photoshop, just painting on it, uh, you know, from um, for painting like, like a 2D texture to put onto a 3D mask. And it just uh, happened on accident. And I'm like, this is really cool. So I saved it. And then I was like, oh, my God, it's gone. It's gone. <laughs> so I actually went digging in my old thumb drives and files probably for an hour or two. Finally found it. I'm just like, thank God. <laughs> and I still have a copy of it. And my little... Um, um, Avatar is just a little 3D stick dude there, you know, and uh, the, uh, the little channel marker, the, the watermark that's in the bottom right over there, uh, that was gone too. Uh, yeah, so luckily I did find everything back in my old files and everything like that, and uh, I was able to finally, um, you know, re upload everything. But it had uh, it had been ten something odd years where this banner was up there. I was like, you know, what? Uh, I'm I'm happy that I found it. But maybe uh, maybe it's time for something different. So the one that's up there now is actually uh, from another project that I had done uh, for my senior year in college. We were making a video game, and this was part of the concept art. That was on there, and I thought it came out actually very, very beautifully. Um, I actually had that um, in another video, The Art of Play, somewhere in my videos, like a thousand videos ago, ten years ago. As yeah, I had a couple of pieces in an art show, and I was actually pretty proud of that. So that was there. So I was like, no, 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 no. I'll put that up there. <laughs> this looks really nice. Yep. And uh, then and now and maybe a, a video, I know the Power Ranger video when I reacted to that one. And uh, other things here and there that I had done. I, I don't really like go live like ever or do any kind of voiceover on my videos. I mean, yeah, I, I could have for like all my uh, Star Wars walkthrough videos, but at, at the time when I had first started, I had watched other videos and other campaigns of different people and just like, well, I mean, uh, overall kind of takes away from the content because I didn't really, really, uh, didn't really uh, care uh, or about anybody's opinions I'm like oh this scene things are happening I'm like uh huh <laughs> yeah so that, that's why I had chosen not to do that I just wanted the content to speak for itself besides it's me and they're my characters uh, you know the names that I had given them me you know my choices because it's a Bioware game has choices you know, um, everything about that was unique to me, so I felt that was enough. And I didn't really want to detract from the viewer experience watching my videos with me saying X, Y, Z about this. Or, you know, there's, there's actually a few on there who are actually pretty violent gamers who just, you know, to go crazy and swear left and right. And just, I'm just like, uh, we, we, we don't kind of content on here right now. I I didn't want to be like that. I just wanted to play and have the content speak for itself. And I, what, what is it? My uh my first video on there uh that I had done was the walkthrough for the Sith Inquisitor and that one has 
oh, I don't know, was it 30, 50,000 something? I, I don't remember exactly, but it had a lot of views, a lot of likes, and I'm just like, thank you so much for everyone who's been watching so far. I hope you all enjoy my content and that you'll continue to like it as, as long as you guys are still here liking my videos, commenting, subscribing. In the past, many of you have asked about my well-being when I haven't posted in a while. And, yeah, you know, life happens. And if the Johnny Depp trial is proof of anything, life does happen. And life has definitely happened to me a lot in the past. So just thank you for everybody who has and who subscribed. And if you're watching this right now and you haven't subscribed, go ahead. Why not? It's free. <laughs> Uh, okay, so um, I think it was a few days, probably not much longer than a week after I had gone through the whole ordeal of republishing all of my videos individually and um, you know making all the changes back because I had to uh, re put in my playlist. You know, and just uh, everything like that as far as my channel and all my links had uh, disappeared also. So this is actually a little diagram that I found on how a YouTube Live uh, could be set up. And I was just like, yeah, that, uh, that pretty much makes sense. <laughs> um, however, that's not what happened. <laughs> So, uh, Johnny Depp, I, now I don't think Johnny Depp himself hacked my, my YouTube and played a recording as live that had already happened a few weeks ago. And I was just like, whoever did this clearly did it for like the views or, you know, what I, I cause there was, there were links in the uh, description of the video to probably some kind of malware or spy software that, you know, to steal your identity or info or, or what have you, you know, just all kinds of this and that happening. So, yeah, so th this is like how it most likely should be, but like I said, that's not what happened. So, you know, it, it, if, uh, if any uh, YouTube creators, you go to like your live page and uh, you see like um, something like this, you know, um, so this uh, is usually like blank, but it, it was something like this, you know, everything had been filled out. I didn't do any of that. It, uh, it filled everything out itself. It said Johnny Depp, you know, live, uh, post trial interview, some, something to that effect. And I was just like, what? even is all of this. I sure as hell did not do any of this. Oh, man. And, yeah, so when you start a stream, it should be like this, you know, blank, and, uh, you know, other than, like, its default choices uh, in there. And, uh, but, yeah, no, that, uh, that, that didn't happen. <laughs> so, uh, it, it, uh, it, it actually said streaming software under the uh, live. I think there's at least two of them on there that I had to get rid of. But the thing is that this happened twice, though. So it happened the first time uh, a few weeks after the trial. And then it happened a second time. I'm just like, oh, crap, not again. So I had to get in there, you know, redo all my passwords again, redo this again, redo that again, and all of my videos had been uh, pre-hidden, uh, so I had to public them all again individually, you know, some 1,500 videos, whatever I have at this point, and, uh, you know, re-upload the playlist. Uh, my name changed, the banner, everything like that. This happened twice in the span of maybe like a week and a half. And I was just like, oh my god, not again. <laughs> this ridiculousness that was happening. You know, it's just crazy, crazy. 
But luckily, none of my videos were deleted. You know, it was my freak out that it happened. And I was like, oh, my videos, no. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, they're all still there. Um, yeah, I just had to reset everything again, essentially. And I really hope it doesn't happen again. I don't think it will because I, I redid everything again. Uh, put in more security, did this, did that, you know, so I think it's okay. I mean, if anybody did this, I just screw it, people. It's, it's clearly her, you know, it's clearly Amber. She, <laughs> I'm more convinced now that Amber Heard hacked my YouTube than Johnny. <laughs> I mean, come on. If, if anyone listened to even half the things she says on the stand, after she has been clearly proven with hard evidence, you know, witness testimonies, video recordings, audio clips, you know, paperwork, X, Y, Z, this and that. And she's still saying all this crap. I'm like, what are you doing? You taking lessons from Trump? Look how that how well that worked out for him. Got in, impeached twice and, and you're you're in debt. What now? It, uh, Thirteen million dollars, something like that. <laughs> Whatever it was, because I think it was fifteen, but uh, there was a cutoff for like the state that they were having the trial in, and that brought it down to like thirteen. And then uh, Johnny owed her two as part of the jury trial. So what was she down to? Like negative eight, ten million dollars. <laughs> And she is definitely not worth ten million dollars. You know, I mean, honestly, did anybody even care that much about Amber before she got married to Johnny? Before all of this happened, before she brought that up, I am gonna say a whopping no, because if you said Amber heard to anybody, uh, you know, even before Aquaman. Like, oh, that chick from that orgy scene. Like, yeah, yeah, that's her. I mean, uh, what was it, that movie called? The Informers or something, whatever. I don't know, you guys can check it out on Mr. Skin. But uh, anyways, so that, he, that actually came up in a trial also where she, well, well Johnny was stating that uh, she had come to him about an issue where, you know, she felt like, um, she wasn't getting the roles that she was supposed to or something like that because all she did and the majority of them was take her clothes off. I'm like, okay, well, first of all, it's your choice to do that. You don't have to do any of that. <laughs> that thing of all, Johnny, it was explaining to her that, yes, this has happened already. A lot of people only think of you that way. And, um, you know, right, right now we're, <laughs> we're going to think of her that way. And as the girl who ruined, or attempted to ruin Johnny's half life and pooped in his bed. That's, <laughs> there's really no getting around that right now. But anyway, she had come to him with that problem, and he explained on the stand how he tried to help her with that, saying that this doesn't have to be. We can take steps, you know, to move your career along to the place where you want it because you don't have to do that. But... Honestly, at this point, how is she going to make money? <laughs> you know? I mean, what, counter suits? I mean, you're just going to rack up more money. And how much does she owe her, her lawyers at this point? An entire team of of them, you know, Mr. Rottenborn and the rest of them. You know, it's, it's craziness. I mean, it's just ridiculous to what she did them, and there's no reason for that, you know, she could have been happily married, it was a fairy tale, the way that they're living, but honestly, who's going to trust her or hire her after she's been proven guilty and fabricating all of this ridiculousness, you know, all, all the lies about Johnny, about him being a wife beater, I mean, he's the one coming out with, <laughs> with all, all these pictures that he, he didn't even, you know, submit them per se. These were like dug up from, you know, different uh, social media accounts, you know, dated and everything like that. 
but you know, Amber has all of these pictures ready. You know, I, I mean, the majority of the pictures you look at it. Okay, here's one filter. Uh huh. And here's the second filter. The <laughs> picture, the second picture has a filter on it. You know, I mean, if you if you line them up one on top of the other, same exact photo. And just like that, and so many other crazy things that happened in the trial, all of this, ugh, all of this craziness that Amber did to him and to the world for that matter. It's like, you're the reason why we don't have the next Pirates movie right now. You're the reason why he was removed from Fantastic Beasts 3. You know, you're the reason so many things that are unfair to the public, but more so unfair to Johnny himself, because Johnny, you know, one of the nicest guys in the world. I mean, the, the after she threw his phone off the the balcony and he was recovered, the homeless guy brought it back. I mean, the, the security guard went on the witness stand saying that we gave him apples, we gave him money, we gave him water bottles, we gave him food, you know, just all of these things. I mean, who does that? You know, who who basically gives like a homeless guy off off the street for returning your phone like a week's worth of meals and money? You know, Johnny is like one of the nicest guys that you could ever hope to have in your life, and this is just terrible what Amber's lies have caused him and his fans. So that's that's my little rant on all of the um oh, the Johnny Depp defamation trial. I mean I'm I'm glad that he was proven to be correct and that she was proven to be a liar. You know, because we don't need people like that in this world. It's screwed enough. It's screwed up enough as it is. You know, so Johnny, if you're listening, I seriously doubt that you would be. But, you know, me and mine, we've been on your side. And we are happy that you can move on and your life has been given back to you by now. You know, we're, we're happy that you won the defamation suit and everything. And look forward to seeing your future projects. And yeah, so that is what happened to my channel. As of right now, it's up and running. I can upload videos. You know, everything seems to be fine. I really hope nothing else happens. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I've, uh, I've taken steps, changed things, reset things, but yeah, it should be okay by now. But uh, yeah, so uh, that should uh, wrap it up. And uh, to all my subscribers, thank you for being with me as long as you've had. I hope you guys stick around. I hope you still enjoy my content. I look forward to putting more videos out there. And to anyone not subscribed, like I said, why don't you just hit the button? It's free. <laughs> I put out good stuff. <laughs> well, thank you for watching. And everyone, just be excellent to each other.